What's up guys? Today I'm cold calling 100 different businesses to try to get some new clients from a marketing company, Hammer Forge. Lots of people say cold calling is dead, but today we're gonna put that to the test and we're gonna find out if cold calling really dead or are people just lazy and don't wanna do it because it's the most awkward, horrible, awkward thing you'll ever experience in your entire life. Today we're gonna find out what the answer is. So the first strategy I'm gonna try out is the I sent you a letter and I'm calling to follow up strategy. Moving like craft cities. Uh, is this is this Land Tree or Land Clear Inc? Yes, it is. Oh, what did what did you just say? Moving like craft cities. Oh. Four businesses. Oh, wow! Congratulations. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was calling because I sent you guys a letter about Google Ads, like uh, I don't know, like a, like a month ago, and I was calling to see if you guys got it. Um, you'd have to talk to my husband about that, and he's on a job over in South Carolina. Oh, well, that's cool. Well, okay, okay, uh, do you want to give him my info, or do you want to give me his info and just give him a call? Yeah, I can take down your information and have him give you a call. Okay, uh, my name's Jesse, J-E-S-S-E, -S -S -E. and then Eckel, E-C-K-E-L. Okay. And um, the, the letters, I, I'll run like Google ads for like land clearing companies. Um, and if you can, like if, if, if your company can handle more business, it's usually like a couple extra clients each month. And depending on your guys' prices, sometimes it's like five to like $20,000 that you guys are able to pull in each month. Um, okay. Yeah. Well, I will pass this on to him. All right, sounds good, thank you. So call number one didn't go exactly as I had hoped it would go, but I was trying to remain optimistic. My thought was that the more that I called people, the better I would get, so it was really only uphill from there. But I had no idea how wrong I was. <sighs> call number two. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. The mailbox is full and cannot accept any messages at this time. So most of the numbers that I called literally just went to voicemail. So I would say my name, I would say my number right at the beginning of the call, I would say why I was calling, and then I would say my number two more times at the end of my call, and then that was that. I got a ridiculous amount of voicemails. And I actually kind of like the voicemails because the voicemails couldn't reject me. The voicemails, they were just like, little robots that I liked, that took down my number and my name, took down my little message, and carry, carried it on to their robot overlords who control them. I like that. Hello? Uh, Houston, Chad Phillips, Phillips Free Service, can I help you? Hi, I just left you a, a voicemail. Yeah, I was just calling to see if you got my, my uh, letter I sent like a month ago. Uh, no, no, I can't remember, no. Uh, well, it was asking if you're interested in uh, marketing help with Google Ads. Oh. <sighs> Hello, we are not available now. This is Ethan with DC Water Construction. I am unavailable at this time. Hi, uh, I was calling to see if you got the letter I sent you guys about a month ago. Uh, letter? It, it, was a, it was about marketing. Oh, yeah, we're fine, man. I got 140 work orders. I gotta take care of that. Oh, okay. No problem. Thank you. So, I'm gonna switch up strategies, and I'm just gonna tell them exactly why I'm calling, like, the first thing I say. I'm up. Hi, uh, I was calling to see if you'd be interested in some marketing stuff. Uh, not at the moment. I appreciate it. Okay, thanks. Bye. Hi, I help land clearing companies make an extra ten to twenty thousand dollars a month. Are you interested? Hello. Hi, is this Jackson Grading? Yes. Hi, uh, I help. Do you do land clearing too? Yeah. Okay, uh, I help land clearing companies make extra money each month um, doing marketing. Is that something you're interested in? Hi, I help land clearing businesses make an extra $20,000 a month. Are you interested? That's it. That's all I'm saying. Not saying anything else this time. I feel like it's hard because I'm really, I'm a really good improv guy. 
Like, I, I feel like I'm really good, like, on the phone when I'm improvising, but when I have a script, I feel horrible, but I also, it's, ugh. All right, what about, hey, no, I'm, I know. Hi, I help land clearing companies make, hello. Hi, is this, uh, land clearing, land clearing? Hello. Hi, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah, do you do land clearing? Yes. Uh, so I run a marketing company that helps land clearing companies make an extra $20,000 a month. Is that something? I help land clearing companies make an extra ten dollars to $20,000 a month using Google Ads. Are you interested? Hi, I help land clearing companies make an extra ten dollars to $20,000 a month using Google Ads. Are you interested? Hi. Hey. Eight, eight. One seven nine three five nine. Hello. Good afternoon, LPS. Hi. This is a, a this is a cold call. I was just trying to get home. I suck at this. I'm so bad at this. Hi. This is a. Hi. Uh, I have a marketing company and I help land clearing companies make money. That was a that was a really bad intro. Yeah, that was. That was <laughs> Hi. I uh, run a marketing company helping tree service companies make more money. So obviously I didn't get any leads thus far. I have had one person call me back since then, but they also weren't interested. I, I don't know. Okay, I didn't get any leads. I didn't personally get any results, but that doesn't mean cold calling is dead. That just means that I suck at it. Like I was horrible at cold calling, but I could imagine if you perfected the art, if you're like, you know, you're doing it every day. You're in the you're in the minefields of cold calling, and you're trying to you've perfected your art, right? That I imagine you'd be really a lot better. You could I imagine you could grow to be a lot better at it than I was, and uh, through that, I could definitely see it yielding results because I had a lot of people that picked up, and I had a lot of people that listened to me at least respectfully for a little bit. Most of them were ready to say no, but that's how a numbers game works. Most people are gonna say no, but you're gonna looking for one or two or three who are gonna say yes. And I definitely think I could have gotten two or three yeses had I been, again, a little bit better at it. So, no, I don't think cold calling is dead, but it is just one of the most insanely difficult things you will ever have to do in your life if you have to do cold calling. Uh, but it also makes you more resilient. Uh, by the end of it, I just felt like a machine. I felt like Arnold Schwarzenegger. I felt like the Terminator. You can't say anything that is gonna even touch me. S dumb people on the phone who are rude to me. It doesn't even hurt me. I have like rhinoceros skin right now. And I, I just feel like an animal. I feel like a strong, powerful, I feel like a dinosaur. I feel like a strong dinosaur, right? Like a T-Rex. <sighs> like, a, like a dog T-Rex. That's what I feel like after cold calling. If you just if you just feel like you're just somebody who like is constantly just really sensitive to how people think of you or if you're somebody who just really struggles with rejection just cold call people it'll that burn that right out of you you'll just you'll come out of it just a refined warrior ready to face all kinds of I just want people to reject me now it just energizes me Somebody rejects me, I'm like, thank you. Anyway, new videos come out every single week. I'll probably never wear this shirt again. See you guys next week.